a little goat, a little cobra. He's ready to come in. He's our juvenile. You got to watch this one because although he's small in stature, he will let you have it. It's rather like walking a dog that doesn't have any manners. A billy goat. It's a pretty good animal. They, they know exactly where they're going. You don't have to tell them. He knows where home is. And he knows that his pack or his herd is waiting for him. I cable these guys if they're outside of the main fenced area. And as long as you don't have any obstructions, it's pretty safe and pretty effective. Sometimes it's funny, you look like you have a crop circle from these little fellas. Oh, there he goes, he's hungry. He knows he's got some, some alfalfa, some orchard hay waiting for him. There's a little prize. Let's take a look and see who's waiting. Oh, Papa Goat. Come here. I'm gonna go home, guys. I'll see ya. Goats are real sociable animals, believe it or not. And they can be they can be kind of tough, but only because it's instinct. They're usually pretty good to follow your lead. This one in particular, he's a real nice fella. It's the little ones you have to watch out for. It seems like the Blair Witch Project here. It's really just dark. This is what I've been feeding them. This is um, orchard hay mixed with alfalfa. And you really don't have to give goats too much nutrition this time of year. But uh, in this temperate area in the Northwest, it's warm most of the year, warm enough anyway, to where they can live off what's growing. Um, but in general, I like to offer just a little extra for them. This old barn, this old 330s. Those 330s, uh, are used for wildlife trapping for nuisance wildlife. I normally don't use those. I use live humane traps. Real windy, real windy night tonight. If you like stomping around at night in the woods, there's lots of these videos. Adventure. Thanks for subscribing, and if you haven't, please do next time on Adventure.